Good evening. Hello. Hello, people. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How was your day? How was your day, guys? Did you have a good day today? Did you have a good day? Were you happy? I'm happy. To... <laughs> okay, good. Well, people, welcome to the class. Welcome to the last class of this module, pre-intermediate one is um, the class number 16. And today uh, I'm going to show you the topic for this class, okay? In a moment, you will see it. Today we'll have a speaking. We are going to practice our speaking, okay? And uh, in this lesson, participants will be able to talk about different topics. So we have in the activity number one, we have reading and vocabulary. In the activity two, speaking about different topics and more practice. So we are going to start by taking the attendance. So let's start with the first person in the list, Alejandro Jovel, Andre, sorry, Ana Elizabeth Garcia. Andrea Sánchez, Braulio Heriberto. I'm here, teacher. Okay, good. Carlos Martínez. Present, teacher. Y Carlos, Claudia María García. Present, teacher. Claudia Yesenia Évora. Christopher Peña. Here, teacher. Okay, Christopher. Eh, Damaris Isabel Castellanos. Denis Eliseo Gutierrez. Doribel Areli Arriaza. Present, teacher. Eli Antonio Sandoval. Elise Preston, okay. Emmanuel Portales. Eneida Verónica Ramírez. Eric Daniel Herrera. Fernando Arturo Mendoza. Irma Adriana Segura. Present teacher. Okay, Irma, good for you. Irma Zuleima Grande. Jacqueline Rebeca Cermeño. Janet Rosibel. Present teacher. Okay. Hello. Jennifer Marisol Iraeta de Torres. Jessica Susana Manchang. Present teacher. Jimmy Ramos. Okay, thank you for connecting on time. Congratulations. <laughs> well, um, let's start. As I told you, uh, today we are going to start with an activity about a vocabulary. You can see the alphabet here, the ABC. And I'm going to give you I'm going to assign you letters of the alphabet and you have to tell me words, a word that is start with the letter of the alphabet. For example, if the first letter is letter A, what is a word with the letter A? One word in English that starts with the letter A? Apple. Okay, apple. Very nice. Sorry, the check. <laughs> yes, it's correct, apple. So now I'm going to assign the people the letter and you will be ready. 
Vale, les voy a decir la letra y be ready. Estén listos, ok. A Braulia with letter B. Ok. Like in Braulia. Claudia María, letter C. Janet Rosibel, letter D. Doribel, letter E. Jacqueline F. Irma G. Jessica H. Carlos Alberto I. Eh, H. I. Ok. Christopher J. Eli K. And Jennifer Marisol L. Ok. So we're going to start. With the letter, what well, with the letter A, you said apple, or we can say airplane. The word can be an object, it can be a verb, a country, animal, food, etc. Okay, Braulio, letter B. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. Letter C. Class. Class. City. <laughs> okay. We we'll write city. Letter D. Date. Uh, sorry, Alejandro. Ev every person has an assigned letter. Ah. So in your case, well, the last letter I think it was L. So, Alejandro, your letter would be M. Okay, Alejandro, letter M. Okay, letter D. Diamond. Diamond, okay, diamond. Letter E. Elephant. I am called elephant. Elephant, okay. Letter F? Fish. Fish, okay. Letter G? Gab. Gab, okay. H? Happiness. Oh, I like that one. <laughs> Letter I? Ice. Ice, yes. Or ice cream. J. Joker. <laughs> okay. K. Kiss. Oh, kiss. Okay. L. Lion. Roar. M. Alejandro. Mouse. Mouse. Okay. Mouse. Mouse. Okay. Everybody help me with the letter N. Yeah, Noise. Noise. Yes. Number. Okay. Letter O. Ocean. Ocean. Yes. Ocean. B. With the letter P? Pizza. Potato. <laughs> okay, potato. potato. Q? Question. 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 Queen. R? Rat. Can you repeat, please? Rabbit. Rabbit. Okay, rabbit. Letter S. A strawberry. A strawberry. Letter T. Tomato. You. Unstoppable. Can you repeat, Jessica? I'm stoppable. Okay, I'm stoppable. 
letter V. Vision. Vision, okay. Also a veterinarian, vet, etc. A W. Winter. X. Xylophone. Xylophone, great. And with the Y. Yellow. <laughs> Yellow. And Z. Zebra. Zebra. Okay. <laughs> Very good. We have a lot of words that you know in English. Can I have a volunteer to say the, each letter of the alphabet? Just the letter of the alphabet. Who can tell us the alphabet? ¿Quién se anima a decir el alfabeto? Ay, teacher. Ok, Braulio, go ahead. Yo, teacher. <risa> eh, ok. Eh, a, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, N, N, O, P, Q, R, E, S, T, U, B, W, X, Y, Z. Excellent, Braulio. Good job. Okay. Sometimes uh, we get confused with the vowels. What are the vowels in English? The vowels, the five vowels? A. A. E. E. I. O. I. O. O. U. U. Yes. So remember, this is A, E, as in elegant, elephant, mm -hmm. I, as in ice cream, I glue, O, and U, okay? Other letters that sometimes people confuse is G, which is G, and J, okay? G, J. We also have the H, okay? Letter C and Z, Z, okay? So, yeah, thank you for practicing the, the alphabet, okay? Now, guys, we are going to read an article about what's in the name. So, you will see some names. Do you know any people with this name? Do you know people with the name George? Can you raise your hand? Do you know someone's name? Someone with the name George? Okay, good. Jacob? Do you know, you can raise your hand. Do you know someone whose name is Jacob? No, nobody? Michael? I know, two Michaels. <laughs> okay, we have two participants. Stanley? Do you know someone whose name is Stanley? No? Claudia, only Claudia. <laughs> okay, uh, and, and who is the other person? Okay, only Claudia. Someone whose name is Betty? Or Betty, do you know someone with the name Betty? Conocen alguna Betty? Or Emily? I know Emily. <laughs> okay, Jane? Do you know someone with the name Jane? Or Nicole? Maybe you know someone with the name Nicole. Okay, Jacqueline knows. Okay, very nice, good. So we are gonna read the article. I need three participants, three volunteers to read the paragraph one, two, and three. Paragraph one. One volunteer to read the paragraph. 
My teacher. Okay, Alejandro. Uh, the second paragraph, Braulio. And the third paragraph, Claudia. Okay. What's in a name? The first paragraph, Look. your name is very okay. important. Okay. Your name is very important. When you think you yourself, you probably think of your name first. It is an important part of your identity. Identity. Okay. Thank you, Alejandro. Identity. Next, Braulio. Right now, the two most popular names for babies in the United States are Jacob for boys in Emily for girls. Why are these names popular? And why are some names all popular? Claudia? N names can become popular because of famous author, actors, TV or book characters or athletes, popular names, suggest very positive things. Unpopular names suggest negative things. Supersingly, super people generally agree on the way they feel about names. Here are some common opinions about names from a recent survey. Okay, thank you. And we have another paragraph. I need another volunteer. Another person. Jessica, Susana. So why do parents give the children a popular names? The biggest reason is tradition. Many people are named after a family member. Of course, opinions can change over time. A name that is unpopular now might become popular in the future. That's good news for all the George and Betty's out there. Thank you so much. Okay. And we have a list of boys' names and girls' names. I need another volunteer to read the boys' names and girls' names. Hey, teacher. Okay, Jimmy. Boys' names. George. Average. Boring. Jacob. Creative, friendly. Michael, good looking, athletic. Stanley, nerdy, serious. And the girls' names. The girls' names too, Jimmy, please. Okay. Girls' names. Betty. Old fashioned, average, Emily, independent, adventurous, Jane, plain, ordinary, Nicole, beautiful, intelligent. Okay, thank you so much. So, as you can see, the, the article talks about popular and unpopular names, right? and how people are named after famous actors, TV actors, or athletes. Mm -hmm. Okay. And we have that in the past, there were some names very popular, like Betty's and George in the United States, right? Now let's check true or false. Your name is part of your identity. True or false? True. It's true. True. It's true. People often feel the same way about a particular name. True or false? Yes. 
people of the okay it's true because it says here names can become popular because some famous actors tv or book characters were ugly popular names suggest very positive things and popular names suggest negative things surprisingly People generally agree on the way they feel about names. So people generally agree on the way they feel about names. So the statement says, people often feel the same way about a particular name, true or false. True. <laughs> it's true, yes, Braulio. Okay, number three. Boys' names are more popular than girls' names? True or false? True, true. No. <laughs> no. That's not true. It's false. It's false. It's false. The article doesn't say about that. People are often named after family members. But oh, sorry. True or false? Dice algunos personas, bueno, personas son a menudo los les ponen nombre por un familiar, por un pariente. True, teacher. true. It's true. People are often named after family members. And um, opinions about names can change. True or false? False. Opinions about names can change. True or false? True. Yeah, it's true because it says that names that were unpopular in the past, they can be popular now. For example, I see that now many people are named um, Camila or Mateo or Camilo. And those names were not popular in the past, but now they are. So I want you to talk about names, about your names. I have here some questions. For example, what's your full name, your complete name? How do you spell? And you can ask about first name, middle name or last name. Uh, the other question is who decided your name? Who decided your name? Your mother, your father, your grandmother, your grandfather, a friend? Who decided your name? Do you like your name? Do you know what your name means? ¿Qué significa? ¿Sabes qué significa tu nombre? Do you know what your name means? What names would you like for your children? ¿Qué nombre te gustaría para tus hijos? Or if you have children, what name eh, do your children have? Mm -hmm. Or what are your children's names? What names are popular in our country? So you will grow, you will work in groups and you are going to discuss these questions, okay? For example, if I ask uh, Irma Suleima, what's your yes, full please. name? My full name is Irma Suleima Grande de Cuellar. Okay, how do you spell Suleima? Um, C U L. E, um, I, M, A. A, yes, very good. And okay, another person, Jennifer Marisol, who decided your name? Who decided your name? Your mother, your father, your grandmother. No la escuchamos, Jennifer. 
Um, my mother. Your mother. Okay, that's good. That's good. Okay, so you're going to have a conversation with your classmate about the name. Okay. So it's going to be very interesting to know about your classmate's name. So please go, go to the break room. I will send you the question. I will send you the question. Yeah. In a moment. Hola. Hello. Hello. Vamos a hacer esas preguntas. Yes, you're going to ask and answer the questions. Ya se las envié, pero no les ha caído. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I don't know what happens with the internet, my internet. Okay, there you go. Ya le apareció la salita. Dice seis, teacher. No sé si seis son. No, en la sala uno. Entrar a la sala uno. Ok. Mire, yo logré accesar y me, me rebotó y no pude accesar al grupo. Ok, Alejandro. Voy. Entonces lo voy a asignar. Igual bueno, yo... no. Nuevamente. Ok. Try it now. Yeah, John, what's your full name? B E A N. Uh, my name is full number. Is uh, my solidarita. Vamos a ir contestando individual. Teacher, lo vamos a hacer individual, no lo entendimos. Tienen que hacerse las preguntas. Unos con otros. Sí, entre, entrevísense. Es sí. speaking practice. Sí. Okay. Okay. It's an interview then. Yes, interview your partner about the name. Jennifer. Okay. What's your full name? Uh, my name is Jennifer Marisol Iraeta Torres. How do you spell Jennifer? A A E N N La I Hey. Yes. Yes. There's a whisper. <laughs> There's a whisper in the ear. <laughs> On the ear. Is um, B uh -huh. R A U L I O. Excellent. And who decide your name? Uh, I, uh, my father. Oh, your father. 
Yes, mm. he is beside my name. Perfect. Do you like your name? No. Why? <laughs> no. Why? <laughs> uh, is because it's strange. No, no sé cómo decir. Strange. Strange. Uh -huh. Es que siento que es muy extraño. Hubiera querido llamarme de, o sea, no sé cómo. Otro nombre. No tan Carlos, común, pero maybe. no tan extraño. <ríe> así como Logan, algo así. Wolverine. <ríe> uh -huh. And do you know what your name means? Uh, My name is. Ay, no sé cómo se dice. Como búfalo en, en inglés. No sé cómo se dice. Pero una vez lo busqué y algo así me salía que significaba como. Como búfalo o como todo. Algo así. Búfalo. Bien, bien raro. O sea, no es que significaba eso, ¿va? sino que según supuestamente los. Este, ajá, como que de, 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 ajá. Buffalo. Buffalo, ajá. And what name would you like for your children? Uh, Christelle. Christelle and Logan. Beautiful name. And what names are popular in our country? Uh, name, name popular is the Maria. Uh, Carlos, 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 no, eh, eh. Do you know what your name, name what your name means? Uh, yes, Victoria. What name for you like? For your children? Um, no. No. Okay. Uh -huh. Había otra pregunta. Sí. What names are popular in our country? ¿Cuál nombre es más popular aquí en mi ciudad? Ajá, sí. Um, Hay muchas que dicen. Hay muchas. Marías. Ajá, Ana. Ana, Rosas. Ajá, eh, Miguel. A Jorge. Carmen. Carmen. Daniel. Ah. Quiero ver. Hay pari. Bueno, yo le pregunté a usted, no sé si usted me la va a preguntar. Ok. What's your full name? My full name is Jacqueline Rebeca Cermeño López. Who do you speak? I'm sorry, what? How do you speak them? Um, how do you speak Jacqueline? J A C Q U E L I M E, Jacqueline. Okay. How this is your name? Who? My who, father. Who decided? Who decided your name? Who decided your name? My father. Do you like your name? Yes, I like it. Do you know what your name meant? No, I don't. What name? You like for your children? 
My girl, his name, her name, perdón, is Zoe. And my son, his name is Awe. What names are popular in our country? I think it's Joseph. Okay. No. Seguim. Le damos otra vuelta. Ay, teacher, a mí se me traba la lengua. Ah, that's why, that's why you have to practice and practice. Okay. Let's, let's go back. Let's go back to the main question. Father of my... Father This Antonio. meeting is being recorded. Antonio. Eh, my, my daughter, Kati. Um, ah. The name of my brother, Carlos. And the name of my sister, Germana. Sister yes. is. Ingrid, uh, the name of my, <laughs> um, my, my, my children, primo es cousin, no. your children, well, guys, well, guys, we are not in the groups anymore. Now we are in the in the whole group. <laughs> we are together now. Okay, so it was very interesting to listen to different opinions, right, about uh, the meaning. And well, let's discuss some of the questions. Uh, can you tell me? Can somebody tell me who decided your name? Who decided your name? My name? Yes. The spelling my name? No, no. Who decided your name? Your mother, your the father, my parents. My, my parents, my, my mother, directly. Okay. Your mother. Good. Okay, in my case, uh, my mother decided my name. Because they, uh, my parents decided that my mother would name the, the girls and my father would name the boys. Okay? So they, don't, they wouldn't have any problems with the name, right? <laughs> okay, do you like your name? Do you like your name? Or is there someone who doesn't like your name? Who doesn't like his or her name? What, teacher? Who doesn't like the name? ¿A quién no le gusta su nombre? Who doesn't like your name? Me, teacher. Why? I don't like why? my oh. A mi nombre a todos le gusta, pero no sé cómo decirlo en inglés. A mí no. I don't like my name. Oh, Jimmy, you don't like your name, Jonathan. Why not? I don't like my name, Jimmy. Why? Because... This has to be James, no Jimmy. Uh, Jimmy. Okay, so it was. I don't know. ¿Cómo se dice el diminutivo? Uh -huh. The short, the short of. 
the short name of Jimmy. I don't like it because it's not the the, the real name. So it was a mistake. The name is made a mistake with your name. Did the secretary make a mistake? Same? Secretary. Uh, why, why, I mean, I, you were saying that your name was not Jimmy, was Jane. Mm -hmm. There's a problem that the people only take the, the name in the year and put is James. Me hubiese gustado llamarme así, pero no sé cómo es que se dice. Ah, okay. <laughs> okay, you would like to be... Es que Jimmy es el diminutivo, como que le digan Juanito. <laughs> okay. Jimmy es James, James es Juan. Y Santiago. Jimmy es Juanito. Es James Juanito. Es Santiago. Es, igual también es Juan. Uh -huh. Juan. Ah, no, es... Sí, 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 Santiago, sí. Entonces es, es como Santiaguito. <risa> bueno, entonces no me gusta. Ok, Tanatán. Ok. Um, what names would you like for your children? Daniela. Bueno, I have children. Ok, Susie would like. Daniel, I I love that name. Joshua. Okay, oh, Joshua. Okay. Pretty. Okay. Jonathan. Jonathan. Okay. I Solo que bien escrito. <laughs> okay. El mío está mal escrito. And what is the correct spelling? Hmm? Oh, yes, it's J O N. J O H N A T A N. Es el que tengo That's, ahorita. Y... Yeah, and what is the correct spelling? The correct is in. Is J O N A T H A N. Yes, Jonathan. In English. In English. <laughs> in but English. The, real, the real name is the native is. G O N A T A N is Jonathan. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Jonathan. Okay, I have a question for Jessica Susana. Manchan Bruno. Mm -hmm. Okay, what what which name do you prefer? Jessica or Susana? I prefer Susana, but actually people call me Susie because it's short. It's shorter and it's easy to learn. And um, Jessica only called me my family. Oh, okay. Your family yeah. called you Jessica, but then yeah. your friends and all the people, Susie. Susie, yes. Yeah, I yeah, I like Susie too. And yes, and my last names are difficult to pronounce with pronunciation, so I have problem with that. Yeah, they are, they are very, uh, not popular, they are not common. No, uh, they are from Honduras, my first last name, and the second it's from Italy. That's why. <laughs> yes, um, I'm mixed. <laughs> yeah. Do you have brothers? No. No? No. Oh, okay. So, um, well, because your children won't have your last name. Yes. <laughs> yes. Okay. Very nice. Thank you. Thank you guys for sharing your opinions and for talking about the names. Now we are going to practice speaking, asking questions with about different topics. So um, in a moment, you will see this, the wheel. In a moment, in a moment, okay. Okay, I need one volunteer. One volunteer, only one. Okay. 
one person. This is the last class. So. Yeah, yeah, Me. Teacher. Uh, okay, Braulio. Uh, I will spin the wheel. One topic will be chosen, and the topic is daily routine. So, Braulio, you are going to ask one person <laughs> in the class, a classmate, about his or her daily routine. Um, choose a victim, choose a victim. Mm, quiero ver. Mm, Jessica Susana. <laughs> okay. I was prefer about music, but that's okay. <laughs> okay. Braulio, you have to ask her. Pregúntele, ask her about her. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Um, Jessica Susana, um, what, what is, um, ¿qué haces por la mañana? ¿Cómo puedo preguntar qué haces por la mañana? What do you do in the morning? Ah, okay. What, what do you do in the morning, Jessica? Well, in the morning, first, I get up around six a club and, and then I take a shower after that I make my breakfast uh, usually I eat um, fruits milk tea and um, protein protein right protein protein and then I go to my work my, and after that I only work around by hours per day and that's all after that i i do a lot of things right because for example i go to the gym and i spend my time there around three hours per day three two or three hours and i read read listening music i love to listen to music and after that, I do my homework, my cosa de lugar sería? Household chores. Household chores. And practice my English, and that's all. Uh, what time do you do? What time do you take your your lunch in my lunch uh around 12 30 p.m or one o'clock oh, okay okay hey. uh that's okay thank you Blaulia and susie Okay, now Susie, you will choose another victim. And the next victim is, well, the next topic is family. And who is your victim? Susie? Susie, you're going to ask a classmate. I'm gonna choose uh, Jimmy. Mm -hmm. Ask him about his family. About a member or in general? Any any questions about the family? You okay. Okay. Jimmy, do you have brothers or siblings? Or sister? Sorry. Jimmy, are you there? Or maybe you should choose another person. Okay. I had problem with the microphone. Ah, okay. Oh, okay. Don't worry. 
I'm going to choose uh, Jacqueline. Okay. And Jacqueline, do you have brother or sisters? I have one brother and two sisters. And they are they older than you? Yes, my two sisters. So you're the last children. How do you say la de en medio? Middle. 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 You are the number three, the third one. Uh -huh, the, the, how do you say the last three hermanas? Yo soy la, la última. Yeah, the last of the daughters. Uh -huh. The youngest of the daughters or the youngest sister you are the youngest sister the youngest youngest mm -hmm. sister ah, okay okay very good thank you now rebecca you are going to uh, choose a victim and you will uh, talk about you will ask him or her about favorite music. Okay. Uh, Abraoli. What is your favorite music, Abraoli? My favorite music is uh, uh, music Christian. Okay. Uh, what did you singer? What did your favorite singer? Who? Who is your favorite singer? Who is your favorite singer? Mm, my favorite singer is Marco Barrientos. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, and Braulio, choose another person. Okay, okay. Yeah. Elia Antonia. And the topic is pet. Pet. Okay. Um, 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 what do you pet? <laughs> what pet do you what, have? Okay, what do you what, what do you have? Pet? What pet? What pet do you have? What pet do you have, Elia Antonio? Um, or maybe another person because we have no answer. <laughs> okay. Uh, um, Eneida Veronica. What? What do you have pet? What do what you pet pets, have? What pets do you have? What pet do you have? Eneida Veronica? Everybody run away. Okay. Okay, Eneida is there. My pets, my pets, um, uh, my pets, they, they, they dogs, um. Okay, very good. Um, okay, she has dogs. Very good. Now, Eneida, you are going to ask another person. Okay, Eneida, ask another person about friends. Okay, about his or her friends. Okay. 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 Mm -hmm. 
what's what's your what's your what's your name what's your name uh the favorite friends okay um Jimmy and otra persona Jimmy ya participó Oh. Alguien que no haya participado. Está okay. Irma, Jennifer, Janet, Doribel. Irma. ¿Qué Irma? Sí. ¿Adriana o su Irma? Adriana. The name of... The name... Of my favorite friend or best friend? My favorite friends. Mm, her name is Glenda. Okay. Very good. <laughs> okay, people, thank you. Thank you for talking, making questions and speaking, okay, about different topics. We have only two more minutes. So I'm going to take the last attendance and the last attendance of the course, okay, of this class. So please say present or here. Um, let's see, we have Alejandro Cartagena, Alejandro Jovel. Present teacher. Ana Garcia. Ana Elizabeth Garcia? No? She's not in the class today. Okay. Um, Andrea Sanchez? Braulio Velasquez? I'm here, teacher. Okay. Carlos Martínez? Present teacher. Claudia María García. Present teacher. Claudia Yesenia. Christopher Raúl Peña. Here, teacher. Okay, Christopher Damaris Isabel. Denis Eliseo. Doribel Arelí Arriaza. Present teacher. Okay, Doribel Elisa Sandoval. Eh, Manuel Portales, Eneida Verónica Ramírez, Eric Daniel Herrera, Fernando Mendoza, Irma Adriana Segura, Present Teacher, okay. Irma Zuleima Grande, Present Teacher, Good, Jacqueline Rebeca, Present Teacher, Janet Rivas, Jennifer Marisol Iraeta. Present teacher. Jessica Susana. Present teacher. Jimmy Ramos. Here. Very good. So thank you guys for connecting to the classes. Thank you for uh, your participation. And please continue, continue practicing practice and practice and practice and participate in the classes and study. Not only with the class, you need to study more, right? Mm -hmm. And practice with other people. Voy a decir en español. <laughs> Gracias por todo. Sigan practicando. Sigan practicando bien. <laughs> Thanks for your teacher. Pronto nos vamos a ver, teacher. Y también es importante que sigan practicando mucho y que estudien. No solo se queden con la clase, sino que investiguen más vocabulario, lean en inglés, vean videos y eh, busquen más información sobre el tema. Y que también participen en la clase, que siempre que haya la oportunidad de participar o de hablar, lo hagan. Eso les va a ayudar mucho. Okay, 
So it was a pleasure, guys. Have a good evening. Gracias. Gracias. Bye, teacher. Bye. 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 Gracias por todo. Bye. Gracias por todo. Gracias por todo. Gracias por aguantarme, Díaz Alejandro. Gracias por aguantarnos, gracias por aguantarnos. Sí, sí, sí. Ok, good night. No, 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 no. Bye. Good night. Bye. Bye.